Time to go penguin clubbing! <laughs> I thought we were clubbed seals, not penguins. I guess in Ark you club a lot of penguins. You mean the Antarctic? You get that polymer, man. Fucking beating the shit out of those penguins for. <laughs> Poor penguins. It's all our fault. And they have mild no ice physics. Yay. No, oh, great ice physics. I'm <laughs> glad uh, I get to mild participate ice in physics. This. Yeah, Gunther lucked out here. <laughs> <laughs> Not so much for Gunther, though. Gunther doesn't need any help failing. <laughs> he does that on his own well enough. There's like an ice jet. And immediately ran into a flaming barrel. Wow, that's impressive. Yeah. Nice. Even I haven't died that fast yet. Woo. That was such a cool trick. I did nothing. I, I'm happy you got that two times score multiplier and didn't and do anything with it. And then ran to a barrel. <laughs> yeah. I'm already off to a great start here. I pretty much forgot it, how to play barely... since uh, the last time. You're nope, tripping over the penguin to your bike, Gabe. <laughs> Apparently. And smack. You know, it's odd saying that you're still neck even, both of you. <laughs> How? How have you not landed anything? He's been performing some cool tricks, Gabe, but uh, he hasn't actually landed any of them. <laughs> I keep hitting the water. <laughs> God damn it. This is going to be the most uninteresting one. I forgot to press L. The heck was that? Ow. <laughs> Are any of you going to land at least one trick? No, actually. Oh, Gabe did. Okay. Oh, well, I still have not. At this rate, we're not going to get anything. Oh. oh, I got some points. I did it. I finally did it. Woo! And I got so much more. How did I only get 200 points um, for that? I just crashed into a wall. Oh, well, that's been happening to me. Join the club. <laughs> What? Why did it just, like, explode there? You just, like, gave up on life. Do you think that little gathering of penguins in the center is Club Penguin? Yes. <laughs> That's the remnants of Club Penguin. <laughs> I heard a great insult the, the, surviving other, members. the other day of when uh, somebody was talking and trash-talking some other gamer, and he told them to go back to playing Club Penguin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's speedruns for getting banned on that. Oh, well, of course. It only takes a few seconds of once you actually get in the game. Yeah. All you have to do is open up chat. Yay, I've gotten a few points and then I smacked into a ramp and died. Man, there are so many of those online things that are just gone, like Club Penguin, Toontown, Neopets. <laughs> Never played any of them. It used to be one for... Foster's home for imaginary friends, too. What was it? Pretty much just like Neopets? Whoa, I did a wheelie. Wait, they, there was an online game for Foster's home? Yeah, there was. I, was. I don't remember. Was it anything good? Uh, do house chores. Oh. <laughs> How am I always wrecking that, that one? That sounds exciting. Because, you know, just like with so many games, I... You know, play the game so that I can do stupid shit like remedial tasks. Yeah, I know, right? Like when you play GTA and Although, you basically have a second job playing GTA. Maybe I might have fuzzy memories of creating an imaginary friend through that. I don't really remember. God damn it. it oh, I just nosedived. <laughs> How many points did you even need to win this one? Less than what I have currently. No. Yeah. So they lowered the ceiling for this one. Yeah, so you can hit your head on it. Yeah, you're really missing out here, Gunther. This one's real great. And um, I'm having fun, fine, fun, eating popcorn, watching this mess. Wait, we have popcorn? <laughs> they have popcorn <laughs> downstairs. Well, yeah. this is hypothetical popcorn. <laughs> I, don't I think it's hypocritical popcorn. Do you want real popcorn? <laughs> I have real popcorn. But then I won't have room for the uh, actual real Mexican food we'll be eating later. Yeah, that's true. I would just want to go eat Mexican food. <laughs> oh, I made it, so. Hey, look, there's a Jose. Do you think he'll make us some Mexican food? That's racist. Who knows? <laughs> Everybody knows everybody with the name Jose can automatically cook Mexican food, Derek. Jeez. Hey, I know a couple Jose's. 
I only know one. I had a friend in middle school that was Jose. That's the only Jose I know. <laughs> okay, the same one then. <laughs> yes. We share a Jose. He always beat me in tetherball. <laughs> God damn it, Jose. You need to train the rest <laughs> of your life to become better at tetherball, and then eventually you'll just find him when you I did claim 40. one victory one day at recess. Just one? Are you sure about that? Was there anybody to record that? Although he did complain to me that, like, his hand was hurting. And to find the reverse oh, seat. So you beat a cripple. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I needed one victory after I challenged him every single day at recess. <laughs> I needed one. This is like Mario Party where you haven't won yet. <laughs> I and will get a YYA. <laughs> Just you wait. One, we're going to have a recording someday, and I'm going to beat Gabe on a recording. I'm going to make sure that does not happen. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Why do we unlock? We unlock the reverse seat, which is this. Yeah, that's how you die. Not this. <laughs> Which is just one button press short. Or is it this? Yeah, that's, that's one definitely button wrong. how you die. <laughs> so, uh, what's the next map we have? Are we at Volcano Island yet? We are at. Oh, Volcano! We're at the volcano! Island. The record holder is Jerome. The Spartan? We need to get 16,000. This is actually a pretty large map for what it is. And this one's even larger. Well, I mean, I'd hope, uh, you know, a volcano map is large to support a volcano. <laughs> Volcanoes typically are pretty large. I don't want it to be like some sort of cheap science project volcano. Yeah, I was going to say, is it like some kid's science project with baking soda and vinegar? Quick, start the game when he's taking a drink! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it, it probably wouldn't affect his score that much. I yeah. mean, let's be yeah, honest. not really. <laughs> this is Gunther we're talking about here. Do you expect anything great from him? That was a sweet Jeep right there. <laughs> I know, right? It's modeled perfectly. Can I drive that and perform tricks? <laughs> you can try. You can it's run over work, the competition. Though. Oh, and yeah. that thing in the center around the edge? You can actually drive on that. If, if you if kill you can, them, if you then, land on you know, it, there's no competition. Atari. <laughs> I wonder if Atari. Ah, oh, so even many barrels anymore. <laughs> Where do I play ET? <laughs> Let's find out. ET phone home. Is it going to give us a shot of the giant volcano? Yeah, it's showing everything except for the obvious volcano. Yeah, the thing that you would want to see on a thing called Volcano Island. <laughs> and you instantly crashed. Nice. Thank you. Atari.com is still a thing. And their site uses cookies. I don't want you to have my cookies. <laughs> Eventually, I'm going to get on here. No, he and have no cheese blow up. Messages. I want Kablooey! Yay! Don't mind me, I'm totally paying attention to the game and not my phone. <laughs> That's the problem with you, Gunther. You never pay attention to Gunther. <laughs> That's because nobody cares. You only have um, 110 what? points. What? <laughs> what a loser. I just side grinded the wall. The and blew up. <laughs> you should not be able to get that close without being vaporized. <laughs> so nope. did they make this volcano did they build the stadium around a volcano i think they built it around a volcano it was actually a kid science project that got dynamaxed oh jesus <laughs> that's not a very big volcano so many backflips and in the volcano not in the way you would think though because you didn't land in the lava you just phased through the rock yeah <laughs> Hey, you doubled your score. You have oh, tripled <laughs> your score. Oh my god! Oh. You gotta go for the little things. And I just completely biffed that. Well, you still have more than four hundred and forty points. So. <laughs> oh god, I forgot how short this map, this time was on this one. Why you keep getting zero points for things? I don't understand why this happens. I don't know. Life hates Gunther. Yeah, it does. But it also hates Gunther because Gunther gets zero points for things too. Gunther I really forgot how short this this mission was <laughs> on this one. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're almost done, actually. Wow, you just smacked into that so hard. So, I don't think you made the score requirement this time, Gabe. Nope. No, I did not. Oh, wow, only 7,000? Well, like Into the depths of hell we go! <laughs> Sploosh! 
Yeah, it still made it on the Kagoot list. Gunther didn't even <laughs> make it up there. <laughs> Wait, how does Jerome have both the top and the lowest score? I mean, we talked about that illegal cloning rig, right? <laughs> anyway, let's go and re- let's go and refix this failure. <laughs> well, oh, yeah, you only have two minutes on this one. I'll just try not to get in your way as you try to beat this. Well, you're in the volcano, Dang so it. you don't got to worry about that. Well, so am I, so... <laughs> Seems like the volcano's the worst place to go. Yeah, I, I find you, it hard just to even get across yeah, the volcano. Yeah, you would think on a thing called Volcano Island, the volcano would be the thing where you would want to do the tricks, but no, you just ate that barrel. I took out two, that's wow. impressive. Wow, that should be worth some points right there. Yeah. <laughs> what? Where did you go? <laughs> you disappeared. I went home. <laughs> and already beat my old score. <laughs> Come on, Guther. No, not into the ground. <laughs> they were cheering for him, and he's like, yay! People do love me. <laughs> so then he, oh, Jesus. <laughs> you hit so many barrels. Is there a game mode where you just get to run into all the barrels? Yes. Because Derek would be winning at that. You know, I'm sure Gunther's been hitting the beers more than the barrels. Is it really that safe to have explosive barrels this close to a volcano? Seems like a very bad idea to me. I mean, it just seems a bad idea in general to have explosives in a field, you know, where humans are driving. I know, right? Well, you know, video games and their explosive barrels. Video games and their logics. I think there was, like, a store oh, that just had a bunch of explosive barrels and they needed to get rid of them, so they put a fire sale on them and every video game just was like, yeah, fuck yeah, explosive barrels. Heh, <laughs> fire sale. Heh, <laughs> it was an unintentional pun. Why are there cheerleaders in the middle of the fucking arena? The way Gunther drives, they're gonna get ran okay, over. Okay, we're good. <laughs> Guther's like, yeah, I was here, woo! Yay, I made some progress. <laughs> it still didn't make it on the board. <laughs> are you proud of me now, Mama? <laughs> Mama, Wait. why are you only looking at Gunther? <laughs> <laughs> what do you think their mom's name is? We unlocked the chopper and the top pits! Olga? And once we beat... Sure. Tar pits and the chopper. Once we beat this one, we unlock more time on the arenas. Yeah, because that'll help us get more points. <laughs> and to the chopper! But we can we do gotta get to the chopper! Backflips. In Sarah, get to the chopper! Got We're it. going to the chopper! Whee! What yeah, the that's, fuck? that's not gonna happen. <laughs> You're like contouring your whole body. Calisthenics! And soon we will learn that one. And that one. What was he doing there? <laughs> uh, who knows? That was an interesting head movement that he We made. gotta beat up Kojima Akira! Okay. That's racist. I don't know how, but I just assume it is. <laughs> if that was the case, I would have made a Hiroshima or Nagasaki joke. Well, that's just... It's too soon. Does this take place in the movie world of Akira? <laughs> I see no candy <laughs> <laughs> Need to know your animes. Which I do not. Wow, your Wii is really chugging along there. Yes, it is. It can only handle so much Gunther and Gunther. <laughs> Gunther and Gunther are and that, too much. You can dra actually drive around that very top edge there. I mean, you can? <laughs> oh, I'm not going to make it there. I don't even know what the hell I'm doing. There are dinosaurs in those tower pits. What the hell's going on with my view here? Okay, there we go. It's all oh, there. you pressed uh, it. I didn't land land right I in the tower. Okay. missed the angle on that by a little bit. Was that a dolphin in there? Some dolphin in the pit. I don't know. It looked like a dolphin at least when I looked. It could at have it. been. 
What is going on? Okay, well. Oh, you I'm melted in the tar pit. Good now. Ugh! Dang it. Oh, I forgot oh, to press Jesus, left again. Jesus, what the fuck you doing? I, <laughs> I landed right on a barrel. It was like a homing missile. That's impressive. Yeah, that takes some talent right there. That Yay. should be worth points. Right in the needle. There we go. Yeah, I did a backflip. Almost ran into another barrel. I did a barrel roll. Just like they wanted me to. Oh, shit. Yeah, there what was it, What is the point of that? I thought there was like going to be a ramp at the end of that, but no. You smack hey, into a I barrel. Get, I get a you good shot way. on these. And then I hit a tree. This map is not good for living. What map has been good for us, Tim? The first one. <laughs> <laughs> it seemed easy enough. I wouldn't know, though, because Gunther got the free ride on that one. Listen, I'm sorry we can't all be what? super successful like Gunther. Eh, hey, it did a decent-sized trick. And I don't And I died. And then you do that. See. Yeah. Okay, yep. Were you trying to grind on the bones, Gabe? I was trying to figure out where the heck I was. <laughs> it sounds like something that you'd do in Tony Hawk. Grind the bones. Oh. Or a Sonic Adventure. Ah! Or Shadow the Hedgehog, because it's edgy. Ish. And only edgy people can grind the bones. Okay, and it's done. Yep, that... Yeah, these get a bit shorter the further you go on them. And I did not make the leaderboard. <laughs> anyway, look, mon the monkey bar. A new fantasy stunt. What, what is a fantasy stunt as opposed to a real stunt? <laughs> anyway, see, let's go and do this one again. So we can unlock the better timing on here. You keep using this we as if uh, me and Derek are going to do anything. Am I going to at least hit the bar this time? Yes, oh, I actually hit it. Just... That counted? What? No. I just went through a ramp. Did you see what t Gabe did, though, Tim? No. He shouldn't have made that first trick. Let's just say that. I'm I'm like defying physics right there. I was going so slow in the air. I don't know what's going on. I think this game has just completely given up on any sort of portrayal. Um, of I just glitched into that pole. <laughs> any realistic <laughs> physics. Listen, Which, I'll just that say is that actually there, pretty common. There's a place for you stuff. next to me at the bar tonight. Alrighty. Well, my bike just gave up on working. <laughs> I've pretty much just given up on trying to go into the actual tar pits because uh, that Woo! sounds dangerous. Yeah, it's it's dangerous. It's very dangerous. <laughs> I didn't get this far in life doing dangerous things. Well, listen, in preschool, they didn't tell, you know, the kids to not go into the tar pits. Zero points again. I'm just going to kill myself. And land <laughs> on the barrel. <laughs> well, Man, Gabe, why are you being such a failure? <laughs> yeah, you're supposed to be the one dragging us through this. It's like me and playing. very happy drag. I, dr I drug us through it. It's like me playing Halo 5 with other people oh, in God. Legendary Campaign. <laughs> that wasn't a good jump there. That was that was definitely the wrong angle. I don't angle. know. I'd say it was a great jump. Great height. Uh, I'm not sure what just happened there. Well, anyway, we beat the map <laughs> this time. Again, you said we. <laughs> As if I did anything. Bad habits die hard. Woo! I know, right? I probably didn't even make it on the leaderboard again. Yeah, I didn't. You got the long jump record. Did I? Yep, 176.4. Wow. Huh. I'm so good. And we had luck flip out, too. Flip out like Truman was doing when I put him in the basement. He threw <laughs> such a tantrum before we started. <laughs> And now we unlocked six minute time frames. He was just like, no, I don't want to go. It's legendary time, six minutes. So I guess uh, we technically finished the arenas then. That is it. Uh, technically it for the arenas. The timeline, extra timeline we got here went through and will we'll let us go and hit more big, larger high scores for at least opportunities on that. Well, that's good timing, because I gotta go pee.
<laughs> <laughs> but before that, let's check out the new stunts. Monkey bar. Whee! What the? <laughs> Don't worry, flip out's about the same. It's just as nuts. <laughs> it's like momentum just imagine doesn't when exist. You, just, just think, you can actually combine that flip out with a backflip. And your character glitches the heck out when you do it, too. Jesus. Think about flipping twice at speed. You flip twice and the bike flips once. <laughs> God damn. This person isn't human. Well, neither are these physics, you know, but whatever. Yeah, this yeah. one takes so long to do in comparison. Just Whee! Get it on, little donkey. <laughs> Whee! Ride that bull. <laughs> Do you want to have some fun with the that arena now that we have more time? Yeah, I mean, I think we shown off the arenas. Probably just good, just move on to the the yeah. next thing you wanted to do. Okay. I'm sure people can only watch me and Tim fail so much. Just think, I used to get about sixty thousand on each one of these back in the day. Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I can definitely see how this is just one of those games where if you can master it, you can manage some crazy stuff. Now what are we doing? And I'm just going to show you about how bullshit scores I can get with that six minute here. Oh, so we're just going to do uh, one of them for six minutes? Yeah, this is, this is actually just a single player for six minutes. Oh, okay. So I don't even have to do anything. Great. Exactly. No, Gunther! Listen, Gunther had to visit his doctor. I don't know why, but... <laughs> his doctor was probably just like, stop. <laughs> just stop, Gunther. <laughs> You're not getting anywhere. You get paid like $5 per appearance because nobody wants to see you. <laughs> so what you're saying is I need to stop my current diet because it's not good for my health. That is not what I'm saying, Gunther. You need to stop going on a motorcycle. <laughs> <laughs> you need to stop walking outside without your full body brace. <laughs> that was messed up. I, I just don't understand the issue, Doctor. 14,000 in under a minute. You were hitting, making a beeline straight for that explosive barrel there at first. And see, notice how there's much less hazards on this map. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? You can actually do things and not smack into everything. And actually jump over things. What's the point of setting up all those barriers if you're just going to destroy all of them? You know, there was some guy before the show that took, you know, 12 hours to set up all those barriers, and he was just crying as he watched you do that. <laughs> <laughs> you have to reimburse the stadium <laughs> for each one destroyed. It's like the unsung heroes of games that just like take all the time setting up their shop or something, and then the hero comes through and just breaks everything. And that was not you know, I actually have a funny example from that from a different <laughs> game. In in a uh, Hollow Knight, uh, during in like the different areas and like the starting area, you find these uh, signs or whatnot. You can't read them or whatever. There's kind of decoration pieces in the background. Yeah, but a lot of things in there you can actually break. And, you know, you can break the sign, you leave the area, you come back, you'll see the signs, you know, perfectly fixed again. Like, normally, you just think that's just the game, you know, resetting it back to normal. Yeah. But there's an actual character in the game that's going and fixing the sign each time. <laughs> and there is a very rare chance where you can encounter that character and kill him. And if you do, the sign will never be fixed again. <laughs> what the hell? And then after you kill him, you can go into Dang, his, his uh, house, which becomes open. You can find his diary, and he talks about how he loves his job about fixing signs. <laughs> and you just and he's just kind of annoyed life. about how this one guy's just going breaking the sign all the time. Do you, does he fight back when you fight him? 
Oh, no. Actually, if you uh, do end up encountering him, you have to be pretty quick because he'll just run away. No. Because he sees oh. you and you're, well, you're the one that's been breaking all the signs. Yeah, pretty much. When we do get to Hall Night, I might be tempted just to show it off because I think that's pretty funny. But it is pretty rare still, though. There's somebody waving a German flag back there. They're trying to support Gunther. Apparently. <laughs> Wait, Gunther's a Nazi? Well, yeah, 54,000! <laughs> oh, right, right. The uh, uh, prisoner of war thing, right? That's I was thinking of Gunther, who's, you know, the good guy. Fifty-eight thousand. And you still got two and a half minutes. <laughs> I know, right? You know, I hadn't even been 60, paying attention 000. for the last couple minutes as I was going off on my <laughs> tangent. About a hollow night. Yeah. A game you can actually play. <laughs> yeah. And not this game. I mean, if I had a bit more time and tried to learn, I could probably manage something a little better than my, what I was doing earlier, but uh, Gabe would still obviously be uh, Because I'm already at 70,000 some. <laughs> well, I just find it really sad on, like, Halo 5 when I'm playing a game and I'm not trying and I'm still in first place. Mm -hmm. It just makes me sad for the 80, rest 000. of the people that they can't even beat me when I'm not even trying. <laughs> it's like, come on, guys. <laughs> Gabe's just flexing his muscles here. And that was Gresh. And Gunther's uh, flexing his muscles. I might actually break 100,000 on this physical one. Physical therapy. <laughs> the pain means it's working, right? <laughs> yes. At least I have feeling back out. <laughs> oh, he might break it. I'm sure Gunther is feeling places he never knew existed. <laughs> you got a minute left. You got to break 100K. If you don't, then nobody's going to watch our video. Nobody will watch it anyways, but... <laughs> oh, I still count it! How did you get points for that? <laughs> you see, there is another instance, like I was yeah. saying earlier, in the Tar yeah, Pits where... Targets. He landed a trick when he technically it landed, have. then crashed. Yeah, well, that's called crashing. Meanwhile, <laughs> when me and Tim try to land something, we're perfectly fine, you know. Yeah, this is just like heart attack. You know, everybody stopped taking pictures when you were in the air. <laughs> Or at least I'm assuming that's what those flashes are supposed to be in the audience. Yeah. Yep. You know, they all have their old disposable cameras. That or everybody's sending out their Porygon all at once. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> 125,000. Now make it to a million. <laughs> that is actually impossible. <laughs> With that kind of an attitude it is. No, yeah. that... Just because of the time limit this game gives you for these missions, it's physically impossible. Have you seen the world record, though? That's that's actually pretty dang cl close. But. There's three Mike Bensons! <laughs> There's three of them? Yeah! <laughs> Damn! Yeah, nine, one and two. One, two, and nine. <laughs> the one and nine really sucks at life. <laughs> <laughs> And that, that's about how I used to be <laughs> on almost every single map. And there's the Laura Croft shaped cheerleaders again. <laughs> With their pyramid boobs. I know, right? At least the model looks better than, you know, original Laura Croft. Does it, though? A little, yeah. <laughs> a little more detailed. Anyway, with our next video, we'll be doing a bu couple races and maybe a couple of the challenges. I mean, again, you'll be doing these things, and we'll just kind of be there. <laughs> well, old Gunther pulling up the rear.